Hi, it's Bill of Machinery Consultants. We're doing a video today, an inspection video here on a Monarch. This happens to be serial number 43711. It's a model 61. It'll actually swing 17 inches over the bed by 35 between centers. It's called a model 61, and the actual tag on it says 13 by 30. Okay? So it's a 13 by 30 that's actually been raised in the sand at the factory to swing a whole 17. And we're calling it 35 between centers. Super clean tool room lathe here at Machinery Consultants. Totally stoked to show it to you. Okay, we're currently running at 112 RPM. Bedways are great, cross slide is great. Headstock sounds fantastic, feed box. Real sanitary machine. Oh, by the way, this particular machine comes with a uh, an Accurite 3 digital readout. We're just throwing that in at no charge. It was uh, removed from the machine uh, in operable condition, but we're just going to include it on serial number 43711. It's an Accurite 2 axis. They call it an Accurite 3 with the two lathe scales. Here's a spare set of top jaws. These top jaws go with this three jaw chuck here on the machine. We're also including a wedge style quick change tool post. It's a it's an HHP branch, superior quality import, Aloris type. It has five holders, a number one, two, four, seven, and ten. Here's the extra four holders, and one of them's mounted. We always have a full set of uh, owner's manuals that come with the machines. Super nice, Series 60, Monarch tool room lathe, operator's book, repair maintenance, lubrication. Anyway, real nice owner's manuals. Going back to the actual machine itself. That other stuff's worth the price of the machine alone, huh? Thank you. <laughs> running at 112 RPM. That being said, we're going to go ahead and run through some speeds and some feeds with one of my dear associates, Mr. Franklin E. Fuentes. All right, buddy, let's see if you got some gas left in the tank. I hope so. No more smashing your fingers. <laughs> That's a joke we have here at Machinery Consultants. We call it a smash in the finger day. What that means is uh, it's either a Monday morning or a Friday afternoon. We call it a smash in the finger day. Okay, the machine has a full taper attachment with the bed clamp. It's a number three Morse taper in the tail. It's 2 to 120 TPI, 60 threads. On the feeds, it's 0 0.0017 to 0 0.1031 IPPER with 60 as well. Five horsepower main drive motor. Currently wired at 440 volts. Here's that taper attachment. Original factory electrics. Square D, Cutler Hammer, Allen Bradley. Super clean. That's where we're getting all that glare. We need to figure out our lighting. On the bedways. Another shot of the taper. So here's the back side of the bedways. Can you let us see some of your bedways there, young man, when you have a moment? use. The machine was just released from a research facility. So we're including a steady rest additionally that uh, it might need a little bit of modification. It's just off a touch on the... It's off a little bit on the... Uh, the steady rest here is off a little bit off center. And it's a little 
little bit tall. So uh, someone will have to build the base down just a little teeny bit. We're just throwing that in at no additional charge. Thanks, man. Hey, you want to see some feet? Yeah, let's do. Okay, saddle as well as uh, longitudinal carriage at the same time. Elvis, let's try something different on the lighting here. We're getting tons of shadows. Maybe bring it forward and over to the about right there to the right a little bit. A little too close. Back up about three feet. There you go. Perfect. All right. Okay, so we've got a couple of uh, spindle speeds that we're going to run through. What a mesmerizing situation. Gosh, this machine is clean. There's 16 spindle speed changes. Ranging from 19 to 800 RPM. Dimensions of this machine are 90 inches in length by 41 inches front to back. Again, the weight's approximately 4,851 pounds. Rejon taper. Coolant system standard, wedged off quick change tool post. That's a full 800 RPM. Nice, Frank. That's great. Okay, uh, additionally, so we've talked about the machine. It comes with the super killer three jaw chuck, and it has the extra set of top, uh, top jaws, the soft jaws. Wedged out quick change tool post with the five holders. The steady rest. This machine has a live center, excuse me, a dead center. It's got a couple of more staple number three dead centers. Coolant system. Bed clamp for the taper attachment, which is real nice. Again, here's the DRO, the top jaws, the owner's manuals. Okay. So if you're wondering where all this wonderful lighting's coming from, it's this gentleman here. <laughs> Mr. Elvis in the house. Okay, we have a couple of collet chucks. We have a rubber flex. We have a 215 series Harding Sorgen. We have some rubber flex collets. We have a 12 inch Rome four jaw chuck. We have a 12 inch diameter buck six jaw, a 14 and a quarter inch D16 face plate, a 17 inch diameter D16 face plate. We have a 10 inch drive plate. Okay, coming in, we have a Jacobs 18 end drill chuck. This chuck here is super cool. It's made in USA, Portage, Michigan. Right here, it's stamped into the satin chrome finish. Portage, Michigan. It's an eight and a quarter diameter three jaw. You'll note this is also an adjustable style chuck. Super cool chuck. Okay, here's an eight and a quarter inch three jaw Cushman. It's a part number 8236 D6. Here's the rubber flex collets. Nice lighting, nice lighting. Thank you, sir. Elvis hitting us on the light. So that, uh, that's, a, that's a Jacobs rubber flex collet that goes into uh, a rubber flex uh, D16 direct mount rubber flex collet chuck. And these are our 215 series Harding. 
Her name's Sorgen, takes a 215 series collet chuck. These are some serious collets. Anyway, let us know, we have a couple of uh, 215 sets of collets. Steel body, Union, D16, 15 inch diameter. Absolutely killer, D16 chuck. Step back on the lighting just a little bit, see if we can get more flavor, there you go. 15 inch. 5C collet set. These are some options that we can list under the tooling. If there's anything that you're interested in, they'll be shown on the quote. Full nice offering of 5C collets. We have a Jacobs drill chuck. Fourteen and Jacobs drill chuck. I mean, most of these collets happen to be Hardinge. So, let us know if there's any tooling that you uh, you need quoted. Okay, so back to the machine. I'd like to thank you for your time to review this this Monarch Tool Room Live. Well, uh, let us know if there's any questions we can, we can answer. We're here at uh, 801 531-9500. Our website is www.machineryconsultants.com. Hope you can see everything clearly on the, on the billboards that we have on the back. My email happens to be mci at machineryconsultants.com. That's mci at machineryconsultants.com. So until next time, be happy to be healthy. Thanks again. Have a great day. Look forward to hearing from you soon. Peace. Held it.